Thanks to Lenovo and Intel for sponsoring this video. Stick around to the end for details on how you can win your very own Legion gaming setup worth over $3,000. As someone who's always been interested in gaming laptops, the overly gamer aesthetic that they typically have has always sort of turned me off. Well, say hello to the all new 16 inch Lenovo Legion Slim 7i Gen 8. It's a laptop that can run AAA games while still being agile enough for on the go working professionals and content creators. Most importantly, it doesn't look like your typical gaming laptop. And I love that. I mean, the only clear giveaway that this is even a gaming laptop at all is the Legion branding. And that's only something another fellow gamer would recognize. For everyone else, it's just a very nice looking laptop. The brushed aluminum frame looks super premium, especially from the backside. I like that the bottom of the laptop slopes inward slightly, making it way easier to pick up. This little nook on the lid here makes it much easier to open. The IO on the back has labels that light up so you don't have to fumble as much when plugging things in. And this electronic shutter for the 1080p webcam is huge for that peace of mind when it comes to privacy. Yeah, the design just feels well thought out. You've also got a wide variety of ports, including two USB-C ports that support up to 140 watt of power delivery and DisplayPort 1.4, one of which is Thunderbolt. There is an HDMI 2.1 port on the back and a full-size SD card reader for us content creators. Portability is a big selling point here. The Slim 7i itself is surprisingly thin by gaming laptop standards and weighs just under four and a half pounds, which isn't exactly light per se, but for a 16 inch gaming laptop, that's very, very impressive. Even when you include the 230 watt charger, the entire package is still very manageable in a backpack or messenger bag. Taking a look at the deck, this is the Legion True Strike keyboard. Keys are nicely spaced out, very comfortable to type on. You get one and a half millimeter of key travel. Definitely one of the better laptop keyboards I've used. A couple of interesting things here. This has an all white backlight with two brightness levels. But don't worry, you can opt for per key RGB lighting if that's something you care about. I personally prefer the white. Second, this has a numpad and full-size arrow keys. Not all that useful for gamers, but they're clearly considering the working professional here. The trackpad is good, it'll get the job done, and of course, for security, you've got a Windows Hello fingerprint scanner right above the keyboard. The light around it doesn't just let you know that it's powered on or in standby, but will also change color depending on what power mode the laptop's in. Red for performance, blue for silence, and white for balanced. Screen-wise, this is what Lenovo calls their pure sight gaming display with G Sync. There's actually three different screen options. Mine is the more pixel dense and color accurate version. This is the obvious choice if you're going to be doing any sort of photo or video work. It's a nice looking IPS screen and with a variable refresh rate of up to 165 hertz, it's still plenty smooth for gaming. The hinge has the perfect amount of tension. You can open the laptop comfortably with one hand and it doesn't wobble when you're actually using it. It's very solid. It can also open up to a completely flat 180 degrees. And from this angle, you can just see how thin this thing is. Running out the audio experience are dual two watt bottom firing speakers tuned by Harman. Packed aside, this is powered by the 13th gen Intel Core i7-13700H processor paired with a NVIDIA GeForce RTX 4060 GPU and 32 gigabytes of RAM. That gives this laptop plenty of power, not only for gaming, but for all sorts of professional workflows, including video editing, which is what I've mainly used it for. It handles multiple layers of 4K with transitions and color correction with no issues, so it gets a thumbs up from me. It's also available in a few other SKUs, including up to an i9 and RTX 4070 if you want more power. Also worth mentioning is that this comes with a 99 watt hour battery, which is important because it's the largest allowed in the internal cabin of most airplanes. Now, you can't just throw everything together and call it a day. These components can generate a lot of heat under load. A laptop that runs too hot will have performance issues and a shorter lifespan. And we don't want that. Lenovo's equipped this laptop with a couple of components to combat this. First of all, this has their updated advanced thermal system called Lenovo Coldfront 5.0. Wait, hold on, let me check my notes. Quad copper heat pipes, phase change thermal compound, and an all new air intake plus 90 blade fan system. Sounds fancy, right? It pulls in cool air from both the top and bottom with exhaust vents on the sides and back. Second, this is paired with Lenovo's AI Engine Plus powered by their custom LA chip, which uses machine learning and AI to lower fan noise, reduce heat, and of course, improve performance. This allows Lenovo to push the total TDP of the Slim 7i up to 140 watts. Even if you don't truly understand what any of that means, 
the end result is what really matters. To take advantage of all this, head into the Lenovo Vantage app and make sure you're in the balanced thermal mode with the Legion AI engine toggle checked on. I'm one of those people that likes to set it and forget it, so I've been mainly using this thing in balanced mode and letting the AI chip do its thing. I know there's plenty of gamers out there who are passionate about tweaking system settings and all that jazz to get more performance out of their laptops. Yeah, that's just not me. The fact that the Lenovo AI chip is capable of doing a bunch of that stuff automatically behind the scenes, yeah, that's a huge plus in my books. Life's busy enough already. After a long day, I just wanna boot up my game and start playing. And if you're anything like me, I think you'll appreciate what Lenovo is trying to do here. I've been planning to build a desktop PC for gaming, but I seriously think a portable hybrid device like this that I can get creative work done on and still scratch that gaming itch from time to time is perfect for me. I've downloaded a bunch of games that I've been meaning to play for the longest time and have actually been enjoying the PC gaming experience during my downtime. Performance in every game I've thrown at it has been great, including titles like Red Dead Redemption 2, Witcher 3, Halo Infinite, Forza Horizon 5. While the keyboard deck and bottom of the laptop will get slightly warm under load as expected, they both measured in at more than acceptable temps. Even after a couple of hours, the entire laptop stays perfectly comfortable to the touch. In all seriousness, this is a device that's changing my perception of what a gaming laptop can be. I'm hoping we see more and more devices like this in the future because I think there's a lot of customers out there like me who want a gaming slash workstation laptop with great cooling so that it can run those triple A titles, but in a slimmer, sleeker package that won't look out of place in more professional settings. It's definitely a tough juggling act, but I think Lenovo's found a good balance here. As promised, for a chance to win your very own complete Legion gaming setup, which includes a Legion 5i Slim Gen 8, backpack, mouse, keyboard, and headset. Click and follow the steps in the link below and leave a comment on this video what game you play on it if you won. Once again, huge thanks to Lenovo and Intel for partnering with me on this video and giving me the chance to test out the Legion Slim 7i Gen 8. I hope you guys found this video informative. As usual, thank you so much for watching. Until the next one, I'm out here.